Hello everybody, welcome to class. My name is Rachel, come on in and let's get started. So you are gonna need a soft um, ball, like a Pilates ball, a squishy ball, a playground ball, because this is our two mile cardio ball walk. I'm so excited you guys have asked me to bring back more workouts with the ball, so here we go. All right, but we gotta get warmed up first, especially your arms since we're gonna be holding onto this ball. So let's just put it off to the side right now and let's get warmed up together. Here we go. We're gonna review our basic steps to our walk aerobics program. Simply just walking in place right now, walking to the beat, just getting used to things. So the ball that you pick, it needs to be not weighted, okay? It's not a heavy medicine ball or anything like that. If you don't have anything besides a weighted ball, then make sure it's only one or two pounds because this is a cardio ball blast workout, not a strength training workout. And if you don't have a ball, you can always do a hand towel and kind of make it in the formation of a ball or just clasp your hands and you should be able to do most most, if not all, of the exercises, okay? <clears throat> all right, roll those shoulders. Nice, good breaths. Here we go. So we are here together for actually 35 minutes. You guys know I like to get our full two miles of walk aerobics walking in, which would be 30 minutes. And then like I like to do an additional uh, extended stretch and cool down. That way we are ready to end our day or start our day safely. All right, let's go to single side steps. We're stepping out to the side, bringing our body back. Looks like this, step, step. Now it doesn't matter which direction you go. If I go left, you go right, it doesn't matter because we're doing our side steps to the beat of the music. Now, I want you to pay attention to your range of motion during this workout. With adding that cardio ball, we may have bigger range of motion and we may get our heart rate up higher. If that is not good for you, all right, if you need to be careful of your heart rate, then keep your range of motion, your movement smaller, or don't use the ball at all during this workout, okay? Nice, good single side steps. Four, three, two. All right, we're heading back to our walking. Looks like this. Bigger range of motion now with those arms and those legs. to count in those four beats when we're following the music because as you know with my class the beats progressively get a little faster till we reach the peak of our class and then it comes back down so it's like what a lot of fitness instructors will call a pyramid workout okay where we're working a little faster and a little faster till we get to the top the peak of the mountain and then we gradually come back down safely all right front kicks in four three two one Little kicks to the front. Nice, good posture. My shoulders are down, my hands are on my hips, so I can make sure that my shoulders are in line with my hips, so I'm not leaning forward or scrunched forward. All right, straight up and tall. There we go. Kick it out. Four, three, two, one. Back to our walking. Now you're gonna do that same concept where we're alternating our legs for front kicks and we're gonna do single knee lifts. Again, doesn't matter which leg you use, single knee lifts in four, three, two, one. Knee up. There we go. There we go, nice, get up. Now if you can't bring your knees up very high, that's okay. Four, three, two, one, back to our walking. All right. Do we feel a little warmed up? All right, let's do one more movement and we're gonna pick up that ball because we're almost done with our warm up. Two up and two back. One, two, back, back. Up, stretch those arms up and stretch them down. So we're warming up those shoulders and back. <clears throat> two more. One more, here we go. 
All right, stay in place. Go ahead and grab that ball for me. All right, we're gonna catch that next beat. So you're just gonna hold the ball right here, chest. All right, mine's a little squishy, so it's a little easier to grip, okay? Hopefully yours is too. Hopefully it's not so solid that it's slippery. Okay, walking in place. We're gonna work a lot of our abs today because of some of the movements that we're gonna be doing with this little ball, okay? So, you get cardio, you get abs with our cardio ball. How exciting is that? All right, we're gonna chop hip to opposite shoulder. Looks like this, hip, shoulder, hip, shoulder. There we go. Nice, good fluid motion. We're walking in place. Now, when we do this full two miles, we're walking the whole time, we're moving, okay? If you feel like you can't do upper body and lower body at the same time, then I want you to just not do the ball, okay? Because it's more important to keep our legs moving the whole time. We gotta get those steps in, get those miles in. There we go, hip to shoulder in four, three, two, one. All right, guess what we gotta do? We gotta do the other side. All right, get ready for that other side. Here we go. Hip, shoulder. Beautiful job. So do you feel that little bit of a twist when you're going from hip to shoulder? There we go. Keep it walking. All right, I'm gonna count you down for four. Three, two, one. All right, nicely done. All right, holding in here. All right, arms are straight. We're gonna do some front raises and then we're gonna add on from there, okay? So my arms are gonna be straight. Front raise, forward, down, forward, down. My arms are straight. So we may be getting a little faster with this beat with the ball. So that's why it's really important that this not be a weighted ball. So these are front raises. So we're not going above our shoulder right now. Four, three, two, one. All right, we're gonna add on to this. All right, instead of going halfway, we're gonna go all the way. All right, so hip overhead. down, up, down. Still just walking in place, everybody. Nothing fancy right now. We're gonna add on one more time to this. I know you can do it. We're gonna slow it down a little bit with the beat though. In four, three, two, one. All right, come down for a second. All right, I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do. So we were doing front raises, then we did front overhead. How can we add on? We're gonna work on those triceps. All right, looks like this, here we go. Up, tricep, up and down. Up, bend, up and down. Up, bend back and straight down. So see how I'm doing those triceps? Up, so keep those elbows in. Up, down, up, and down. Woo! All right, can we do four more? Four. Three. Two. One more, one more, one more, one more. Woo! I'm feeling this in my arms already. Oh my goodness. All right, stay here. We're gonna boost up the pace a little more. Oh my goodness. All right, these next two songs to end our mile and to start our mile two are gonna be our fastest songs. So we're getting to the peak of the class, all right? All right, holding this ball. 
One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right, let's go to single side steps. Here we go. Step, step, step. Figure eight. There we go. So it's a figure eight laying on its side. So we always get those legs going started first before we add those arms in. So I'm just doing that single side step, adding those figure eight arms. Beautiful. Now you can stay here and do smaller figure eights or you can really get that ball weaving. If at any time you need to take a break with using the ball, that is totally okay. I want you to keep moving and just set that ball down and keep doing all the leg movements, okay? And you can add your own arm movements if you have set the ball down. All right, in four, three, two, one, back to our walking. So we take just little breaks in between because we're gonna go back to those side steps again and just do a little different motion with the ball. <clears throat> All right, pick it up. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm just holding the ball. Back to side steps, here we go. Step, 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 step. Isn't this a great beat? All right, just hold that ball. Step, step. All right, hip to hip, looks like this. Hip, hip, hip. So a half circle, like you're drawing a rainbow. There we go, keep it going. I think we can change these side steps to skaters. What do you think? Looks like this. And then we can do an even more with our range of motion with that twist, with the hip to hip, taking that toe, tapping behind the opposite heel. That's our skaters. It's a different variation of our side step. This is what's great about the SWAC aerobics class is you can take four or five basic movements and make them all kinds of different variations and patterns. It's so much fun. I've been teaching walk aerobics classes Gosh, I don't even know now. I think it's been at least five years, and I love it. Back to our walking. Here we go. One, two, three, four. All right, holding that ball. Woo. Nice good breaths in and out. We'll take just a quick break to catch our breath. Let me check my heart rate. Yes, my heart rate is up. Woo! All right, two more minutes. Hang in with me for two more minutes. We're gonna finish this mile, and if you need a quick sip of water, the end of our miles are a great time to do that, but I want you to listen to your body, and if you need water at any time, you go get it, okay? But just make sure you come back. No walking away and not coming back. All right? All right, single knee lifts. Four, three, two, one, knee up, 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 up. So I'm making my knee lifts a little bigger than I did during my warm up, because my legs are definitely warmed up and are more flexible. All right, ball forward crunch. There we go. So look, I'm just holding that ball and I'm crunching forward. I'm bringing that ball towards the knee, but I'm staying to the front to get that little bit of forward crunch. Nice, good inhale and exhale. Little crunches to the front in four, three, two, one back to our walking. All right, just hold on to that ball. We're gonna go back to those single knee lifts in just a second. All right, I'm gonna pinch. take a break with my arms. I think I may need a water break. Woo! Even though this is only 30 minutes. All right, nice, good inhale, and exhale. All right, holding on. All right. Go to those knee lifts one more time and then we're going to end our mile. Here we go. Knee, 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 ball to knee. So 
we're adding that twist back in instead of that forward crunch. Ball to knee, almost to the outer hip. Ball to knee, here we go. Up, up, up. Who's ready to end this mile? Are we ready? Four, three, two, one. Back to walking. Congratulations. We just finished one mile together. Now we're gonna keep up with this fast pace, okay? Grab a sip of water if you need it. I know I need it. All right, it's a lot of work when we add this ball, isn't it? It's fabulous though. I'm so glad you guys requested more of these ball workouts. All right, I want you to keep walking in place. All right. single kneel heel digs. We didn't do heel digs in our warm-up, so let me show them to you. Heel, heel, heel. Again, working those legs, those shins, the ankles, holding on to that ball. All right, keeping it at your belly button, right below our chest. Push out now. Here we go. Push, 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 push. So I move around so you can always see me from the front profile and the side profile. Sometimes a little hard to figure out placement with things if I just stay in one direction. So that's why I move around a lot. There we go. Heel, heel, heel. Woo. Four, three, two, one. Back to our walking. And then we're going to change these to side taps. So side taps looks like this. Tap, tap, tap. So we're staying in place. Our single side steps, we move our body from side to side. With our side taps, we're standing still and stretching out that foot. Working those inner thighs. There we go. Keep it going. We're going to do the same thing we were doing with our heel digs where we're pushing out. Single counts. Push, 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 push. So you can stay straight up and tall, or if you want to sink down some more, work on those inner thighs. There we go. You're doing awesome. Side tap it out and push. Okay. Four, three, Two, one, back to our walking. All right, <clears throat> we're gonna do something different. We're gonna do side to side squats. I may have to slow it down with the beat. I'm gonna try it first, since this is our fastest beat. All right, step out and up, out and up. So I'm showing you first, you're still walking in place, then when you feel comfortable, you're gonna join me. So step out, back in. Step out, back in. Out and in. So the ball coming down as you're stepping out. Side to side squats. So squat down, we're not just stepping out to the side. And four. Three. Two. Set. Back to our walking. Woo! Nicely done. All right, open up those legs. Nice, good, wide walking. So we're going to go to mini squats next. Mini squats looks like this down and up, down and up. So I'm pointing my toe. I'm just lifting those heels. There we go. My arms are straight, working on that core twist. Left to right. So my arms are staying straight, still coming up and down with that mini squat. See how I'm keeping my arms straight? So we can work on that core twist. Down and up, down and up. Don't cheat those legs with those mini squats. Four, 
four, three, two, one. Stay with your mini squats. Here we go. Holding that ball, pushing down. Push, 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 push. All right. We're about to end the song, and we're gonna go down a little bit with our beat. Right, beautiful job. We have one more working song. Then our cool down, and then our stretch. We're still pushing down, mini squats. Down and up, down and up. Four, three, two, one. Back to our walking. Like this may need to be a little louder. Let's see if it gets a little louder and then I'll turn up a little bit. All right. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right. I'll go ahead and turn up just a little bit. You know, it's really important for us to hear the beat. All right, we're going to go back to walking in place doing a couple more movements with this ball. And then we've got to put it away, you guys, because we're our cool down. All right, arms are straight, elbows are in, so we can do our bicep curls. Come up and down, up and down. There we go. Nice, good bicep curls. We're gonna work on hand coordination right after this. See how we do. Our goal is not to drop the ball, we'll see. Curl up and down, up and down. Beautiful job. You guys have stuck in with me so far. We're almost done with our two miles. Like I said, we have our cool down song right after this. So we're gonna slow things back down, get rid of the ball, and then we'll do our extended cool down and stretch. So we'll end at about 35 minutes. Curl up and down for four, three, Two, one. All right, around the head looks like this. Down and around. Around. All right, one more. Switch directions. Round. Round. Slow it down for next one. <laughs> one more. There we go. All right. Woo. All right. We did around the head. We're going to do around the waist. Looks like this. One, two, three, four. So I'm passing it to my other hand going around. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One more. All right. Switching directions. One, two, three, four. Three, four. So we're going slow. We got four counts to get all the way around. Can we do one more? All right, there we go. All right, switching from hand to hand looks like this. Switch, open, switch, open. So we're passing it from hand to hand, opening up those shoulders opening up that chest one more time. Those arms open, pass and open. Just walking in place. All right, in four, three, two, one. All right, stay here. All right, now hopefully your ball is squishy enough that you can hold it with one hand, like this. If you cannot, then don't worry about it, okay? All right, one hand. Now you can skip this part and just be walking in place if this does not work with the ball you're doing. All right, front raise and side raise. Front, down, side, down. Two 
two more. Front, down, side, one more. All right, switching sides. Woo, shake out that arm. All right, straight arm, forward, down, side, and down. All right, one more time, here we go. Front, down, side, down. halfway. I am counting. <laughs> A lot of times I forget to count. All right, two more. One more, everybody. Come on, come on. All right. Let's finish up with that ball pass again. Open. 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 So how'd you do with the ball? We had the ball for about 20 minutes out of our two miles. So job well done, everybody. All right, four, three, two, one. All right, everybody, welcome to cool down. Let's set that ball down. All right, here we go. Throw those shoulders. Now, our cool down, just as important as that warm up. Okay, we go back to those basic steps. No fancy patterns, no equipment, just keeping it basic for the next couple of minutes while we finish our cool down and start into our standing, standing still stretch. Okay, one, two, three, four. Now our cool down still has a good beat because we want to keep moving this whole time. All right, two up and two back. Here we go. One, two, back, 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 there we go. Will you do me a favor? If you liked this workout, make sure that you hit the subscribe button. That tells me how many people are interested in seeing more of my workouts, okay? So hit that subscribe button, and then every time I upload a new workout, then you're gonna get notified. So you'll never miss a workout, so that's exciting, okay? The second thing is, I would love for you to share this workout with somebody online, okay? Let them know that you just finished this two mile, 30 minute cardio ball walk. You can tell them a little bit about the walk aerobics program. Share with them my workouts. I want to make this year, 2021, our best year yet, as I told you. I've been teaching walk aerobics for at least five years now, and it hasn't been until the year 2020, with everything, with people being in quarantine and gyms being shut down, that I've started doing more workouts on YouTube and our private Facebook group. All right, back to our walking. So I want you to share these workouts with your friends and family, okay? I want us to all walk strong together. I want us to make this year good. Okay, regardless of the circumstances, regardless of how it gets started, I want this year to be better than it was last year, okay? For all of us, myself included. So, we were, I'm going to keep uploading content. I want to get ideas from you guys as to what you like. You have said you love these cardio ball walks, so that's why we have this one in our January rotation. So I can't wait to share with you some more workouts that are coming up this month and this entire year. So like I said, do me a favor, hit the subscribe button and tell people about these workouts, okay? So that I can continue to make free, full length content for you guys. Thank you so very much. All right, let's keep walking to the end. All right, little side steps, step it out. Little tiny side steps, there we go. We're keeping our range of motion small. If you have a fitness tracker that I want you to kind of track your heart rate, you should be able to see when we start our class, so we start to get warmed up, our heart rate raises and raises and gets higher when we get to the peak of the class, okay? And then it starts to come back down, especially right now during our cool down. So hopefully you see that. This is such a fun beat even for a cool down, right? Four, three, two, one, back to our walking. All right, little kicks to the front in four, three, two, 
one. Kick it out. Nice good posture like we did during their warm up. All right, beautiful job. Let's go for just a little bit longer. Four, three, two, one. Single knee lifts in four, three, two, one. Knee up, up, up. Four, three, two, one. And with our walking a little bit too up and too back like we just did. One, two, back, back. All right, did you end with a smile on your face? I hope that this workout energized you. If it was a little too much and you feel exhausted, then try and not use the ball next time, or maybe do one mile instead of two. All right, we're all at different fitness levels, so I want you to make this workout work for you. One more. All right, stay in place. Throw those shoulders. All right, guess what that song means? We're at our stretch. We finished our two miles. Congratulations, everybody. This was our cardio ball walk with abs. So I hope that you enjoyed it. Let's just stretch for a couple minutes together. It won't be too long. My feet are hip width. All right, nice good breath up. And nice good exhale down. Nice good inhale up. Now we use our legs obviously the entire time with moving and walking together, but we also did a lot with our arms with holding that ball almost the entire two miles, with the exception of the warm up and cool down. So we wanna stretch out those arms, okay? So nice good shoulder rolls back, shoulder roll to the front. Beautiful. All right, one arm forward. All right, so right now we're just gently cradling that shoulder. Wiggle those fingers, nice, good breaths. Open. All right, wiggle those fingers. Now I want you to take your fingers, interlace them to the back, just like this. Nice, good inhale and exhale. Now if you can, stay here, or I want you to hinge down. It's a nice, good stretch with those legs. You can do more stretch with the arms if you bring them up. Other arm. Wiggle those fingers. Just holding on. Here we go. Open. There we go. Open and close. Woo! All right, shake out those arms. All right, bring your feet in. One arm up, one arm down. We're gonna sink to the side. Up. One arm straight, nice good stretch. Wiggle those fingers and bend down. Right, keep it up. All right, interlace those fingers, push them out straight ahead. Let's stretch out those legs really quick. Feet are hip width, one step forward, one step back. All right, my front leg is bent 90 degrees, but I can still see my toes, my back leg is straight. My hands are on my hips, okay? Nice, good posture up. There we go. Now you can stay here if you wanna deepen the stretch. I'm gonna lean forward a little bit, but my hands are above my knee. I never rest my hands on my knee. everybody so staying here or if you want to sink down all right coming up let's do one more big breath in together and nice good exhale congratulations everybody 
Thank you so much for choosing to work out with me today and pressing play. I hope you enjoyed this two mile cardio blast and I hope to see you in the next workout soon. Take care everybody.